Hi folks, Pammy here from Pammy's Peck of Pursuits, and today we are just celebrating the fact that I have finished the quilt that I made for the baby. We started out with these five pieces of fabric. I just fell in love with the fabric with the little wombats on it. And we took those five pieces of fabric and sat down and made up a bit of a pattern and we cut everything up and we stitched them all together and ended up with this quilt. Now that's the the quilt, the padding in the middle and the back and after several months of working on it we've got round to finishing off the edging. So I did f about five pieces of fabric that I ironed into an edging to put on the the quilt and joined it and spent several days just stitching away bit by bit just like doing the whole quilt you just do it bit by bit day by day and in the end we've we've finished it and it's all tidied up ready to go to the new baby who arrives in about a week so it's just in time i had hoped to get it done a little bit earlier but Things happen, and I'm just glad that I've been able to finish it on time. And we will be taking it over to my niece and her husband in the next day or so, so that it's there when baby arrives. So I'm just really pleased with it. It's very plain I don't do fancy quilting any type of my any of my art forms tend to be on the primitive side just basic and this is how I've done my quilt just basic blocks and I'm very happy with it it's colorful and it's got those lovely cute little wombats on it and I'm sure that baby will have a wonderful time laying on the mat. It's all wrapped up, ready to go. It's a nice thing about a quilt. You don't need fancy wrapping paper. Just wrap it in cellophane because the pattern just becomes the paper. The, the, it just looks like you've wrapped it in fancy paper, but you haven't. So it's all ready to go. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.